Thank you, you guys are fantastic. Thank you for being here. We may have been walking backwards down Whitehall, but they're the ones who don't know where they're going. We're the ones who want to take our country into a zero carbon future, and they're the ones who want to track under our national parks. Well, you can't. They want to tell us you can get there by cutting funding for warm homes and insulation and solar power. You cannot get to a zero carbon future, do you? They want to tell us you can build new runways and keep driving diesel buses without worrying about the toxic air pollution that's killing 40,000 and more people every year. Well, you bloody well can't. There are times when I'm happy that this government is going backwards. I was delighted, delighted, when they did a U-turn and said they would accept child refugees from Europe. That was going backwards in the right direction. I was delighted when they went backwards and did a U-turn on forcing all schools to become academies. That was going backwards in the right direction. But now we need this government to start going forwards on climate change. Paris was great. The signing ceremony in New York was superb. But bits of paper do not stop greenhouse gas emissions. Policies do. We need an end to unabated coal. We need support for CCS. We need more wind turbines and solar panels. We need low carbon vehicles, ultra low emission zones. We need a government that is prepared to think further than the next election and to legislate, legislate for a zero carbon future. 10 days ago, for the first time ever in the UK, we had more energy generated by solar than by coal across the entire day. That's the future we want. And today, today we have 5 gigawatts, 20% of our energy being generated at this moment by solar power. That's the future that we want. Today, we turned our backs on Parliament and walked backwards down Whitehall because our government is turning its back on the people, turning its back on our future. But we will walk forward together. We will create a sustainable, zero-carbon future because we know something that they have yet to understand. A sustainable future is the only chance that we have to have a future at all. Thank you for being here. Thank you for caring. Thank you. You're fantastic.